Hi, I'm Matt Jones. Uh, welcome to another video, this time looking at split strategy subtraction. Now, split strategy is a mental strategy uh, that is taught in stage two and can be used to solve addition and subtraction equations. Uh, solving a split strategy subtraction equation works in much the same way as solving a split strategy addition equation. Uh, our first step is to find the number that we are taking away, the subtrahend, uh, splitting that up into its place value parts, and then subtracting those one at a time, starting with the largest place value position or largest place value part, and working our way down to the smallest one. Let's take this equation as an example. 79 minus 42. Here we can identify our subtrahend, which is the number that we are going to be taking away, is our 42. Uh, and so our next step, therefore, is to split that up into its place value parts. 42 can be shown as 4 lots of 10 and 2 lots of 1. Therefore, to solve 79 minus 42, we need to firstly take away 40 and then take away 2. Two different steps. Step number 1, 79 minus 40 leaves us with 39. We've now taken away our 4 lots of 10, our 40. We now need to take away our next smallest place value part, which is our 1s. 39 minus 2 is 37. We have now taken away our 4 lots of 10 here and our 2 lots of 1. Therefore, we have completed our equation of 79 minus 42, and we can say that our answer is 37. Solving a larger subtraction equation using split strategy works exactly the same way, just with additional steps. Let's take this number or this equation as an example. 585 minus 321. First step is to find our subtrahend, which is the number that we are taking away, which is obviously going to be our 321. We can split that up into its place value parts by showing the number of hundreds here, 300, two tens, and one one. Now I know that we are going to have three steps to this equation because we'll take away our hundreds, then our tens, then our ones. First step, taking away our hundreds. 585 minus 300. Now we know that if we're taking away hundreds, we are just dealing with the hundreds value or the value in the hundreds position. 585 minus 300 leaves us with 285. Our next step to take away our two tens, 285 minus 20, 265. Our final step to take away our 1s, 265 minus 1 is 264. We have now taken away our 3 lots of 100, we've taken away our 2 lots of 10, we've taken away our 1 lot of 1, and so therefore we, we have solved our equation of 585 minus 321. We have our answer, 264. Thank you so much for your time.